race. This race live from the ATL. This race unapologetically black where our motto is no hate. No fear. But no fear. You got to know when to hold them, know when to fold them, know when to walk away. And we never run. But we never run. Never run. We coming to you live from the ATL where it's still two or three leftover holes from the All-Star game. <laughs> I, I, saw, get home fact, I saw one today, D.C. To save their life. Did you help out? No, I didn't. Hey, man, you know that red hat. You know, you know from a distance, you know what that means. Yeah, there you go with that. Make he, he ain't rich I'm enough to wear a mega you're hat. Sitting in your car, and you, you got a red shirt on. Red, it ain't like a red hat. You're a bigger target than I am. You though. ain't seen no mega shirt. This ain't no mega hat, but it's red like a mega hat. Okay, so I can't wear nothing. He else like red. red. I didn't say no like red. Head. I don't say I'm red. I just asked you, did you realize what you represent? I, I, he I'm like not red. Represent no, 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 nothing. I'm That's Bo Peep. He's a co-pilot. Which means if anything happened to me, good luck to y'all's ass. <laughs> Shit, this show is over. This bitch going to crash and burn. This my Bo P, the down. black box, know everything. <laughs> Except the right thing. I got Marcus Combs on my right. Pow. Just come back off sold out shows. He said he sold them all out. <laughs> he said Corey closed the shows for him. <laughs> <laughs> he needs somebody to turn off the lights, that's all. I got Mook Man on my left. Yes, sir. Mook Man. What's happening, man? Oh, Cricket Eye. <laughs> Damn. You know about my eye, nigga? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Man, he gonna give me credit, man, because Mook Man used to wear sunglasses all the time. I mean, take that's that why he was wearing them, because he didn't want to show that eye. I know. I said, man, well, first of everybody. all, I'll both, be limping. Both of y'all wrong. I wore them because I wanted to. Why you stop wearing them? You stop wanting to? <laughs> you stop wanting to. I wear, I wear it sometimes. And I explain to you. Yeah, listen, man, give me some credit. Man. My eyes have I seen the glory. That could be your calling card right there. My Forrest eyes. Whitaker, without that bad eye, would probably not be Forrest Whitaker. And, and that head. I said, do you, boy? You got some wounds. If you a man, you got some. You know why I be limping? I done been into I've been in some battles, boy. I've been in I've been in I'm a warrior. So you say that shows character. <laughs> you tripped over that big outside. Yeah. Well, well, look, 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 look at Seal. Seal got a scar across his face. It didn't stop all him. All kind of messed up. Yeah. yeah. It you didn't stop lying. him from put, being out there. All okay. kind. You see a pretty, pretty man walking around like the Marco or somebody ain't ain't done shit. Right. <laughs> 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 oh, oh, pretty nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Nah, I ain't gonna even get into that. Damn, Marco. <laughs> oh, he... I got old school over there. What's up, what's up? What's going on, man? Chilling. Well, I don't think I ever seen you without a hat. Hmm. And I see why. <laughs> All them hats, he got winter hats. Because <laughs> he got a shell. He don't need a hat. When you got a shell. <laughs> when you got a shell. <laughs> what kind of shell is it, though? Steel wheel on the ones and twos. Technician extraordinaire. Without and love. Boy, mm-hmm. you ain't got nobody to blame, you know, ain't nobody hollering at you and stuff. <laughs> how, how that feel? <laughs> <laughs> nobody to argue with. We got with. White Mark. We got Head of Security. <laughs> Richard Torrance. Top We got his supervisor here. Yeah. Mr. Torrance. Mr. Old T. man Torrance. Mr. T in the house. Boy, let me tell you something, boy. All y'all think y'all know something, think y'all been somewhere, think y'all... That man promoted me for about 20 years. Yes, sir. Wow. If you were ever wondering, how could D.C. tolerate this boy, Richard? (laughs) There's your wife. (laughs) I've known hundreds of promoters, and that's one is two of my trust. And that's one of them right there. Mm. Put some money in my pocket, too, Mr. Torrance. And you can trust me. Mr. Torrance, glad to have you, man. Good to see you. Richard, you sound just like your daddy. Same voice. I, I met your nephew when I was in, uh, where was that? Uh, Lake Charles. No, I met your nephew in Kansas City the other day. Oh. And he looked just like Richard. You sure that's your nephew? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they twins, man. 
I mean, hey, I ain't no judge. I am, I am not a judge, but I'm just saying. That's your cousin, man. <laughs> you, maybe you ain't seen um, his daddy, his nephew daddy. Maybe maybe that's Richard's daddy. <laughs> yeah, I'm the way. Maybe somebody lying. Uh, <laughs> I know something going on. I said, man, this guy is just hold on. like you. Let me ask if he know this, term. Mr. Mr. Torrance. You ever heard the term rooster roost again again? <laughs> <laughs> I just leave it at that. <laughs> Positive K in the house. Oh, no, he ain't. No, that's old school. That's right. monkey shoulder. Monkey shoulder in the house. Sound right I see it over there. I see it. Sound right extraordinary. He put it down the other night too. I stayed up to watch the late show. Demarco presents. Oh, okay. Show started mm. at two o'clock in the morning, like the old days. Mm. Nothing in there. There's a few holes and pimps. <laughs> <laughs> and, and me. And, and some bums getting some sleep. Everybody drunk. Wasn't none of the funny shit funny. And all the shit wasn't supposed to be funny. Everybody laughing. <laughs> That's them shows that started at 2 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Right. You be like, y'all, they be like, they laughing at that? I don't even know where they at. <laughs> they, they laugh at, how you doing? And start laughing. Mark like, didn't go up. He walking around acting like Don King. Man, get your ass out of here, man. <laughs> 12 people in. You ain't no damn Don King. Marco, you ain't go up? Uh, we started like at one thirty. Damn. It started one, one, yeah, at least. And I had a at guest the most. There. He ain't got no mic. He's saying he had a guest host. Yes. And a, yeah. a few comedians that were actually. He let there. some of them that were on the Naughty by Nature tour. Yeah, go ahead, keep talking. I just, you don't have no microphone, and so I'm uh, translating. Had some out of town people. We had to let them Had some out of town people. The show was only about an hour and 10, 15 minutes. That was enough. Okay. That was enough. That was enough. I was like somebody in church got used bathroom twice. You know, they let you go out once, you hold up one finger. Yeah. Then when you go out second time, you put hold up two fingers. <laughs> then I ain't never seen nobody hold up three, three fingers. fingers. He gone, he gone, man. What is that one finger they hold up when they walking out of church? That's, that means you got to do a number one, not number saying, two. That's but number one and number two. That's, that's, that's that forgive me for disturbing the service. Like this. I go out like this every time. That means I ain't coming back for a while. <laughs> It came from slavery, slavery. Richard said. You were coming back. Damn, that's deep. Real job. That's deep. You was a slave. Where you been though? That's from reading, man. You told you going to the bathroom. You can't go to the bathroom right there on the cotton. Right there. Explain that 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 so the people can hear that. That's some 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 good information. Why in your row, right? He says that that tradition came from slavery. You had to hold one finger up. When you were walking out the field, to let the master know. To let the master know you were going to do a number one. And coming back. You got to be a number two. Number wow. one, they let you do that in the row. I mean, you could do that number one. Yeah. That master show so up that on that horse. To the church. That master show up on that horse with that whip. You do a number two on your stand. Oh, damn, yeah. yes, right You're then. definitely going to do a number two. Yeah. Right then. <laughs> shit all on yourself with a whip. They put a whip on your ass. You're going to take another shit, even if you took one. Oh, that's where that came from. Boy, you live and learn, boy. Yeah. I'm yeah, that's got deep. slave in the house. I'm that's telling you, man. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad. glad. What branch? What slave what unit you was in? You from? <laughs> what set? Plantation. What's your last name? Plantation, Mr. Brown, or Arkansas. Taurus, they had the Taurus slaves. They don't know what the hell we talking about because they ain't never been to church. Yeah, yeah, right. They don't know what the hell. They're long. Oh, he, he was a slave. They, they, they lived in the church. Oh, no. They lived in the Kirk Franklin. They think that's church. That, yeah. What do church Franklin do with slavery? Y'all talking about slavery. Y'all ain't talking about no church. 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 Kirk Franklin is showing that he a real no, Christian. No, he cuss and he watch pornos. You know what the hell we talking I know about? He is a real Christian. He has proven he's a real Christian. He, he cuss and watch pornos. I don't pornos. see no conflict myself. Me either. Me neither. I don't see none either. It's just that his son shouldn't have put him out there like They got a boy in Memphis. They call him Cussing Preacher. He be cussing. cussing. Yeah, oh, it's a cat. Come on. Yeah, I seen that. Boy, I've seen that. Oh, he oh, be cussing. cussing. <laughs> he be cussing yeah. like a stone. And he be funny, man. He funny with it. He's hilarious. Yeah. He's hilarious. Motherfuckers, you motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> How many members he got? All yeah. the heathens. Don't tell me I don't need to be eating no pussy. I eat pussy. I'm a god. I ain't heard him say that. Yeah, now. He nah, he ain't saying he ain't with that deep. No, no, bro. With the girl in the car, he said that. Yeah, he got Dang. caught with the girl in the no, car he giving didn't. him head. 
Oh, oh man. He got caught in the girl in the car giving him head, so he went on about, hey, yeah, I'm a man. And then I eat pussy too. I do it all. Well, Don Juan was a pastor and he's a pimp. Don Juan was a preacher. He wasn't a pastor. He no, he was a pastor of a church in Chicago, man. He was a preacher. I was there he with He was a him. preacher, okay. I mean well, not at the church with him, but I was But he used ordained. to have church. He's an ordained man. He had he had ordained. church. He's an ordained man. And all the hoes used to be there. He's not a pastor. No, right. Okay. Let me let me tell y'all about my Don Juan story. Y'all know, here we go, Hollywood with D.C. So when we got ready to do the third Friday, Friday after next, I'm talking to Don Juan out on the set, and he sent back to Chicago and ordered me a Don Juan player card. I'm an official member of the Don Juan player. Right. <laughs> so he gave me the card. AARP. And everything. So we sitting on the side where they waiting to shoot us. We sitting on the side talking, and he started talking about his taxes. He said, I'm so glad I get them taxes off my back. I said, you killing them, man. I said, hey, well, you, you, you didn't pay your taxes? No, them some bitches hit me up for some extra money because they tried to say I was making all this money, but I told them, my hoes, give me money, them gifts. <laughs> <laughs> I said, that what you told them, Ram? That's what I told them, huh? them, them gifts. They pay no taxes on there. So we kept talking, talking, talking. I said, well, you finally got rid of it. He said, you had my ass hemmed up for seven years. I said, oh, shit. I feel for you, boy. He said, man, I'm tired of paying that $125 a month. <laughs> Damn. Damn. $125. <laughs> I said, that must have been some cheap hoes. <laughs> <laughs> ah, so so I, I got a Don Juan story, too. Tell me your Don Juan story, buddy. So when I was in fifth grade, um, you know, Halloween in Chicago, we throw eggs, right? On yeah. Halloween night. So my dad still was still or y'all used to? No, we used to. Okay. It's fifth grade, motherfucker. Let me okay. <laughs> well, still could be in fifth well, grade. Yeah. <laughs> you made it past shit. that. Just know some of the shit you say. So a long <laughs> long story short, I was on punishment. My boys came to get me. And uh, my dad let me go outside because he feeling good because him and his cousin gambling playing big whist. So he's like, go on outside, don't be out there fucking up. So I get the eggs out the refrigerator, you know, on, on the slick side, put them in the garbage, act like I'm taking the garbage out, and took a whole carton of eggs out. We get to the corner, me and my partner's dumb one pulls up, he got that green over with the flip-flop paint. Wait a minute, green? No, he had green. No, no, back, rose, back then. Rose. Oh, no, he had a green Nova back in the 80s. He had a green Nova flip-flop paint with the kit on the back. And when he pull up, he had a fresh finger wave with the heart in it, you know. <laughs> and he let his window down. He had the light. He said, hey, man, don't y'all throw no motherfucking eggs at my car, man. What did he say that for? And he looked. I, we, they weren't even thinking about this nigga. He's like, hey, Lil Hoppy. So my dad's name is Hoppy because one of the legs short and the other. That's what they call him, Hoppy, on the street. Lil Hoppy, don't throw no motherfucking eggs in my car. <laughs> nigga, that light turned green. And they yoked that motherfucker. <laughs> this nigga pulls over, jumps out. He got a long leather snakeskin trench coat, long leather snakeskin pants, stacked shoes. They break and run. He pointed at me. Come here. I take off running. This nigga kicked them shoes off. When I look back, this motherfucker look like Batman behind me. <laughs> <laughs> got to the corner. He catch me. He just slapped me four, five times. Now, back then, my dad was a big vice lord. I said, man, I'm going to tell my daddy, put your hands on me. He said, nigga, I'm taking you home. Your daddy going to beat your ass. So we get to my house as we walk in. The rain come out of nowhere. You hear me? I'm talking about heavy ass rain. We get on my porch and the light come on. This nigga whole finger wave sm <laughs> swole up <laughs> like vampire in Brooklyn. Look yeah, like Eddie yeah. Murphy. Like Eddie Murphy. <laughs> so my mom come to the door. He said, my mom said, what you doing with my son? He said, go get Hoppy. I don't, I don't talk to no another man, woman. Tell Hoppy I said to come here. My dad said, who the fuck is it? My mom said, it's the pimp at the door with your son. Right? <laughs> Did your he, one leg yeah. ass. <laughs> so he come hopping his ass to the door. <laughs> man, what the fuck going on? He said, man, I just let you outside. He said, Hoppy, I told them niggas don't throw no motherfucking eggs in my car. My dad said, where you get some eggs from? My mom didn't open that refrigerator. He done took the whole dozen. <laughs> <laughs> That we just bought out the refrigerator. This nigga say, man, you are never going back outside. Get your ass in that room. So I'm in my room. My buddies knock on the window say, man, how the fuck you let him catch you? Man, he down there pimp slapping you, man. And that's my dumb one story, man. That's good.
Ooh. That's good. No, no, he's right. a real person, ladies and gentlemen. He's a real person. Uh, hanging out you. It might be. It might be. I've been doing a little something <laughs> before I left. Somebody. Salivated talking it's about it. It's somebody. It's somebody. It might be. Could be. Got a little salivated talking about You got to stop studying me, though. Well, luckily, 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 back then, they wasn't shooting like they're shooting now, boy. Oh, yeah. Uh, we had real childhood, man. Because he just come out and just shot. I, I got yeah, he probably got a shot out loud. I got a like that for throwing snowballs one time. Matter of fact, speaking of that, DC, I was talking to a partner of mine the other day, right? He from... He lived in Minnesota, and he said, uh, when we fought, now Indiana, he grew up in Indiana, he said, when we fought, he said, it wasn't no guns, it was hand-to-hand, he said, we may have a pipe, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, a hammer, Stick a hammer, a crow, he said, whatever your daddy had in the garage, yeah. that was a weapon you brought to the fight. So I said, man, that's got a brutal pipes and hammers, he said, yeah, man, it was pipes and Nobody hammers. Nobody died. Nobody died. But right. You, but you got your ass whooped. You got your ass whooped. <laughs> 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 you got broke up. That was for Can sure. Imagine though, showed up somebody got a pipe. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Heel, heel. You got, you got a hammer. You're like, okay, that pipe a little longer than my hammer. I'm going to get close to it. <laughs> but you can mind your own business now, yeah. man. Two or four. shot down dead. Boulder, Colorado, the biggest, biggest story of the last oh God, three, man. four days. That's mm. crazy. Man. People in there shopping, grocery shopping and... The boy 21. They claim he 21, but now did y'all see the boy? Yeah. Well, look like he's yeah. well, you know, white folks. Yeah. Yeah. Like he a 40 can't old be 21. Man. That big bald spot. Right the back yeah. 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 Beard. Like it, it, it's been growing 20 years at least. <laughs> and they claim he's just 21 years yeah. old. But my thing, yeah. DC, is anytime a white boy go crazy and shoot people, they say he got a mental disorder. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. When black people it. go crazy, they kill us. Well, yeah. like but they, they kill people. When the white, when the white boy shot the spas up. Yeah, in Georgia mm, the other yeah, day, yeah. and the sheriff got on and said he just having a bad day. He said he had a bad day. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. But look, what I'm saying is, That's they say he got a he, he mental, 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 mental illness he's suffering from. But I'm saying he ain't too damn stupid. He went out and bought bullets and a gun. If you're on mental, just, just, you know, if you got a mental issue, are you on pills? Is it cheaper to buy the pills or buy the damn gun? So if he's smart enough to buy the gun, he's smart enough to buy the pills. If you don't, if you got a mental problem, you know, pills help you. Go buy the pills. Don't go buy the gun. They what gets that, me? Go ahead. You know what I'm saying? They, but they go buy the gun, and they kill 10 or 12 people. But when we get pulled, or when they call, the police get called out for us in our community, and he got a mental illness problem, he gets killed. Well, yeah. I think oh, yeah, it happened. It just happened. People. I think they're using that it mental illness happened. thing just to downplay the whole racism. Just to, oh, try, just to downplay it. And they always, they always got an excuse. This boy, you know, you know, they always got an excuse. Tell me he got mental illness. But now, this is happening at the same time that George Floyd, unarmed, right. choked mm-hmm. That's to what I'm death, saying. and is just not getting to trial. There was a Four seat. black jurors, yeah. two uh, mixed race, and then I think six white folk. They're going to have to have my one, whole thing, one of them six white folks to say he guilty. But what my whole thing one. is, if they when, don't, they're gonna be there all night. My whole thing oh, is, this white boy killed. Hornet said he's not guilty as a hunting jury. Yeah, yeah. And I believe they're gonna have DC. that watch. But when this white boy kills that many Minnesota people, up. right? The whole world is compassionate to it. But we didn't see none of that. It was inside the building. We didn't see the gunshots. We, but we feel compassionate for that. But we see George Floyd get killed in eight. In nine minutes. Watch him. Bye. Bye. The police. police. And this video is there for evidence to say, hey, this is wrong doing. But we compassionate for this and we didn't even see what happened. But we see this happen and you still got to deal with this man's family have to go through a jury to decide this man is right or wrong. It's I, sad, bro. But we yeah. already saying this guy's wrong for killing these people and we didn't see none of that. We didn't see none of that carnage. But well, we see this man dying at the hands on video and police killing him, and we got to go to court to figure out if that's right or wrong. That's what I'm What about the, the runner, the jogger in Florida, and the, and the father and son shot him down? Yeah. Is that, Florida? Th- yeah, I mean, yeah. Yeah, Brunswick, yeah. That was in Georgia. Yeah, yeah. Brunswick, Georgia. I'm in on, Brunswick, Georgia. Yeah. I'm yeah. On our Have they started that trial yet? That was almost they, a year no, ago. they're still in jail. At least they yeah. didn't let him out on right. 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 Well, you know, they had a similar situation today uh, here yeah. in uh, Publix. Guy went mm-hmm. in a uh, grocery store with five guns. Wow. Damn. Damn. See, 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 they they, they, they want to go out. Publics higher they than wanna the take people down. They want to take people down on their way out. You know what I mean? Nobody ever gets killed in the liquor store. No. <laughs> no, no, no. In Baltimore, they do. That's so true. We'll be right back. You're listening to this race.